Today is a big day for the people of Finland because today, in 1805, poet Johann Ludwig Runeberg was born. Never heard of him? Well, you're obviously not Scandinavian because he's like the Shakespeare of Finland and he wrote in Swedish. Now, the other thing you should know about him is that he had a cake named after him. There, that got you interested, eh? Runeberg's Tort is a Finnish pastry flavoured with almonds and rum with a bit of raspberry jam and a sugar ring. You can never go wrong with a sugar ring. Apparently, Runeberg enjoyed the tort with a Swedish liqueur for his breakfast. Now, I don't know much about this Runeberg, really, but I do know that we could never, ever go out drinking together. Supposedly, it was his wife's recipe, you know, the tort. <laughs> By tort, I mean cake. Right, the, the tor I don't mean his wife was a tor. His wife was a perfectly nice woman. Oh, she was his cousin, I think, which is a bit weird. But anyway, she baked this cake and then she named the cake after him. Runeberg's Tort. <sighs> Maybe she was mad at him. I don't really know why. <laughs> anyway, do you know that British Prime Minister Earl Charles Grey named a tea after himself in the 1830s? Yeah, I know. Supposedly, someone gave him a gift of tea leaves flavoured with oils and he liked it so much he named it after himself. <laughs> you see, you can do that sort of thing when you're an earl. You go, oh, I do like your gift. <laughs> I'm going to name it after myself. I'm kind of jealous of people who have food named after them, you know. It's the earl of sandwiches, the sandwich. There's Pavlova. Calm down, everybody. Australia, New Zealand. I'm not saying anything about you. I'm just saying Pavlova's named after a dancer. Pavlova. Sheesh. Peach Melba is named after the singer Dame Nellie Melba. I've never heard of her either. I mean, I don't have anything. Maybe technically I could have um, wind digestion. <laughs> anyway, I know what you're thinking. Tell us, what are the origins of the British dish of spotted dick? I actually don't know. And, and you know what? I don't really want to find out. Do you know what I mean? Some things are better left unknown. Do you know, in 2001, hospital managers at Gloucestershire NHS Trust and in 2009, catering staff at Flintshire County Council renamed the pudding Spotted Richard on menus. Some people have too much time on their hands. <laughs>